Peter. Enough talk! The Amakusa will put an end to you, now that it is finished analyzing your abilities. Oh! Itoshiki hito, mamoru tame ni haruka kana taheko! How do we fight all these enemies and still take out that Amarame copy? Tose, I've got an idea. A strategy for turning the script situation around? I don't know about that, but it's certainly worth a shot. I've learned the secret- I've learned the Joestar family's secret technique! Understood. You have my assistance. Don't you want to hear the plan? Nobia, we've only known each other for a few days, but somehow I trust you. What? You're young, but you managed to persevere through a battle I couldn't even imagine fighting. You've earned my trust. Thank you. The move confidence gives me some hope. This attack will work. Alright, here goes. On my signal, run the hell away! Roger! Your opening. After that, it's all yours. Roger. It's up, Bang Ray. We're going all out. By your command. Yes, yes, this is it. This is the Bang Ray's true speed. Now if I could just manage to not run into things. I was right. It's getting confused by the Bang Ray's erratic movements. Now the current type of you type you are, you can't react to something you're seeing for the first time. Now let's show you the tricks I've picked up from this X1. Ah! Toby unlocks a new special attack. Oh, doesn't let fish him off. Amazing, Tobia. That was fantastic. Pulled it off! I used the same combo that Kincaid did! Look out, Tobia! It's still moving! Say what? That beam! Never let your guard down! And it's the rest, and, it, and it's the Yamato with everyone else! And we have basically almost finished off Amaro! And we're just gonna bring everybody. A Gundam? And the Yamato? We mustn't stop until the enemy has been destroyed. That voice! Well, that last attack was pretty nice. That is, that is the protagonist of F91. And the original, and the first crossbone Gundam. Kate, hey, is that really you? Oh, but you're no longer Kincaid anymore. I'm afraid I have to go by Kincaid now. I wish I could going by Kincaid. I'm going by Kincaid now. But my full name is Kincaid now. And on third base. <laughs> Plane later. Focus on fighting the Jupiter Empire. Tobia, Kisaragi, follow in on our position and regroup. Roger. That, that's the Yamato. All units are to cooperate with Kincaid now and attack the Jupiter Empire's base. Alright, so we're so we're cooperating with him now? Yes, you're cooperating with now. To be cops as opposed to later. Gah! The Hayabusa will intercept any enemies that cause the Yamato. The Gundams and Fang Ray shall form the front line. Roger, the Cosmo Falcon squadron shall move to, to defend. Be careful, a new rank mech is being piloted by a biobrain copy of Emerald Ray's mind. Did, did he just say Emerald Ray? Hey, it's not like it's a Char. It's not like it's a, a, a clone of Char. I mean, cloning Char as novel? That's just silly! That would never show up in a Gundam series. Wink. Visitor is pilot. It must have waited, found a way to copy his Kogama data to a biogram. Thank you for shipping a shorter version of the next position that we got a little bit earlier. I knew Pit Dots. You're exactly right, Officer Sonata. I have a kitty on my lap, as you may tell. Amber Ray, the first Gundam pilot.
technically there's a test pilot from before, if you go with Gun in the Origin, but he didn't, wasn't really piloting it for very long. Because the unit was obviously vacant when Emerald held the cockpit. This is Tobia, you can't lose. Your reputation as Earth's last Gundam pilot is at stake. Last in the sense of he's the most recent Gundam pilot? Then, okay, sure. I know, I won't let you down. I'll use this X1 you can trust to me to take out this imposter. Alright, so... We've moved... So... Yeah, you've moved and can't move again. Same with you. And we don't have enough points to just... Well, I was wondering how you to completely evade attacks for one battle. What I'd like to do, actually, is bring the Vang Ray aboard the Yamato to help heal it. Help it heal. Oh, they're frustrating bits. Um. Not it's possible to, like, take out Amuro before thing before the, uh. Yamato shows up. You just healed that last damage I just gave you. I almost had you beat. I had to do like chair a Vulcan cannon damage level. I had Vulcan cannon damage level probably like finishing you off, jerk. So decreases damage taken by 87.5% for one battle. That is incredibly specific. Right, move there and attack. Start taking out. Let's start fighting you guys. Yep, this is the mass production F91. Tessaly will, will have to remain Vera Rona for the rest of her life if we don't defeat the Jupiter Empire. That's why I must put an end to it. I would hope not! Save the stuff that uses ammunition for. I'll save the stuff that uses ammunition, uh, uses ammunition for later. Oh, 
was a lot of overkill, but worth it. Good. Now, now there's a response that actually fits nicely with the uh yeah, sparring dialogue. Everyone's kind of moving into range, but no one's really been attacking it yet. Here we go. Chance for the shields. Drop the shields. This can't be their base. There aren't enough enemies here. Was the Jupiter Empire really rebuilding? The wave motion barrier is basically working like our standard barrier. Right, and now, we can launch the fully charged and fully healed. Gundam, who can now is in the position to finish off Amaro. It's definitely a machine, but there's no way that this is the same Amaro Ray who saved Earth from an asteroid. From Axis Zeon, from uh, the Axis Colony, no less. Let's do this! I won't let you use another pilot as a weapon. Let's try this final attack again. The belt comes in for the finishing blow. Yep, and there he goes! I want the ropes anyway. Got a new item, the dual sensor, and we leveled up again! Big level up too. 
that ended the fight. Oops. I'm gonna grind it from. That cost me the opportunity to grind for more XP. Oops, that was my bad. We're three minutes of retreating. Are they just going to abandon their base? Impossible! How could the Yamakusa be defeated? Well, we actually nearly had it beat right before you sent more troops out than anyway. You did it, Tobia! It looks like the vile brain units are getting away. We'll deal with them later. We should push, push our attack on the base for now. Roger. Sragi and Tobia have entered the Sragi and Tobia have entered the base. Hold our current position. We'll keep this area secure. Good luck, you two! This may not end the bell. What are you talking about? How could it think if the soldier in that base failed their mission? Back at the base. The interior of the base is damaged beyond repair. They can't bi mass produce these those bio brains here anymore. There you are, pirate scum! One of them stayed behind. And the Makusa is gone. I have nothing left to lose. I'm going down, and I'm taking you with me. What's he doing? I pressed the self-destruct button. This base will explode in a matter of minutes. You can't be serious. You can't escape. I've sealed all the doors inside the base. How? How could you do this? Don't you value your own life? Zig Zupiter! Glory to Crux Doggety! Unbelievable! He was just living his life, and now he's going to throw it away? Well, he... Sounded from the sound effect side of things, it appears he shot himself in the head. Tose, we have to find a way out of here first. I'm well aware of that. I wasn't planning on letting him get away with this. Here we go. I've gained access to the basic computer. Tobia, I need you to... Ugh! Ooh, that was a new type flash. What was that? What's happening, Tobia? Talk to me. It's voice. I can hear a voice. Okay, got it. That's how we get out of here. So this is a call out to the original Mobile Suit Gundam when Amro Ray was guard guided out of the inside of Axis via new type communication by uh, Salem Mass, I believe. AKA RTC and I can I can Energy readings are off the charts. The base is going to explode. Is Aragi Tobia? We're apparently did we lose them? I can't tell. Somebody was too cheap to generate a new um, 3D sprite for the base blow that's blo for our blown up base. No, no, they're all right. Isaragi and Tobias units have reported in. Good. Yes, they did it. Welcome back, Chitose. You too, Tobia. And whatever, Zoidberg. You are indeed as tough as you claimed. Great job, both of you. I'll be honest, I didn't think we were going to make it. Did that thing just really just help them escape? Biobrain. Wait, is the Biobrain the one guiding us? Watch out, the thing could be covered by the Empire. Could, the Empire could be disastrous. Destroy it at once. Negative. Stand down. I think it's okay. I'm not picking up any activity from the Biobrain. We never got to say thank you. Why did it help us? I like to think that the justification here is it ditched into Jupiter, so that no one else could use it either. Woo. The wound on your face will probably leave a scar. Like I think the um I think the, the, the nose scar is new. I look even more like a pirate now, don't I? So it's funny. I'm uh, thinking this is a Legion Masumoto shout-out. All of Lichi Masumoto's space pirate characters have facial scars often across the nose. Um, Harlock, it's 
scar across the nose, like the cheek across the nose, and then to the eye, which is concealed either by an eye patch, because he's lost the eye, or by a big mess of hair, or both. And then Queen Emeraldus just has a straight cut right across the nose. How you can be so cavalier about it is beyond me. You do look tired. Do you look tired, though, Tobia? Hey, Chitose? Yes? Why do you think that Biobrain helped us out back there? Well, I can think of a moment from his life that might explain it. I heard he used his new type abilities to safely lead his partner out of a burning ship. So it was Amro guiding Sela out, I think. That one. Here, exactly details. I need to rewatch the original Gundam, or at least the movies. So the voice Toby heard was the Biobrain channeling Amro Ray? It's possible, but it's hard to say for sure right now. But it's, just, it's a machine, just a copy of his combat record and fighting style. So, why did it sound like him? Does it mean this actually learned how to think like him? I don't know, but I venture a guess that if it has, it's truly mimicking a new type's abilities. You may never know how much of that was just a manifestation of the copy new type's powers, and how much of it, how much was influenced by his true feelings. Do you receive that believe that machines can have a heart? Do you believe that love can bloom on a battlefield? That's kind of a romantic thought. I decide, I think we've succeeded in wiping out the Jupiter Empire's forces. Their base is completely destroyed. Now we can focus on taking out the rest of the Empire. What that? You may not have to. It's been a while, Tobia. Bernadette. Captain Barra! Forgive me, you're not Captain Barra anymore, are you? That's still alright, Tobia. I... Quite alright, Tobia. I still go by Barra Rona. As long as the fight with the Jupiter Empire continues, she remains Barra Rona, and I remain Kincaid now. Barra, did you hear, hear you say we may not have to continue our continue to press our attack on the Empire? And how did you get all, all get to Jupiter, or on board the Yamato for that matter? Let's take those questions one at a time. We've been living in the underground cities of Earth. Two months ago, a refugee from Jupiter came to us. I wasn't aware there were refugees from Jupiter. Oh, those would be the people who were settling on Mars. Indeed, they opposed the rebuilding of the Jupiter Empire's army, so they fled. He was among them. He had came to ask me, as a former member of the Crosscode Vanguard, to put an end to the army's violence. It seems the Crosscode Vanguard name has held great significance for them ever since Crux Dogati. Dogati? Someone who's heard this, word, this name pronounced out loud, please post the, the phonetic spelling in the comments or the chat, or whatever. Thank you. So, my ask for SNRI's help. He prepared the F-91 for me, and came from the moon to join the Resistance here on Jupiter. Why didn't you rely on us? Phobia, please. please. You guys worked so hard to reclaim your proper names. Maybe a long way from peace, but you shouldn't have to return to combat. The fight the Jupiter Empire should be settled by my generation, Phobia. But, you have more important things to attend to than waging war on the ghosts of past enemies. Still, I decide. We heard, heard the Yamato, Yamato was headed for Jupiter, so we made plans to join up with it. If you were leading the resistance here, you must have some information about the Empire's forces. I do. The base you destroyed today was the last of them. Serious? Hold on. Does that mean that battle marks the end of the Jupiter Empire? Did we just destroy the last of them? As a matter of fact, yes. Unbelievable. What did they hope to accomplish with such a small force and a brand new weapon? Allow me to rephrase that. The Empire forces have left Jupiter, but the Empire itself has yet to fall. Does that mean... Please tell me they're not headed for Earth. No, they're not. They have set out for the outer reaches of space. Why? Now that the Gamblers are threatening to destroy Earth, it appears they have lost interest in us. Crux Doggity's personal grudge against Earth seems to have been a driving factor behind the Empire's previous invasion. Not to mention, this general sentiment among the people that laying claim to Earth was no longer necessary. They decided simply wasn't worth fighting over a system that Gamble has effectively controlled. Is that so? Is that so? 
This is good news, though. We came here ready for war, and it's just as well there won't be any more bloodshed. I wouldn't get your guard down just yet. Why not? There are others who threaten the people simply by trying, simply trying to get by in this region. You don't mean... I do. There's a gamma space on Jupiter. And now we are preparing to head into the next stage of the next straight-up episode crib from Space Battleship Yamada. Now we're here. Let's do a thing which I forgot to do last time and I really should have done this time. Upgrades. You all need... Well, I can... I can go have enough cash to completely max your energy. Let's do that. I don't know how long you're going to be sticking around. Um, let's go... And let's... Um... That's fine. I do want to boost the weapons on the bank. Boost them by two. Actually boost this for the Yamato as well. Actually, I do want to boost because it boosts the energy. Energy is a good stat to boost for the Yamato because the wave motion barrier is powered by its energy level. So, boost the armor. Whatever damage gets to the wave motion barrier is reduced. Boost the energy and keep the wave motion barrier up for longer. I'm curious, how much can I? Okay, can't go all the way at everything yet. Let's not even go all the way on something. I want to max something out. Let's max out mobility and let's max out armor. Let's do this with a couple others. Basically trying to get this up to so that it is harder to touch the Huckabean. I'm probably gonna pump that into armor as well. So the skill level determines the time you use it, not the number of time, not the power of it. I 
actually like these ones because well, these ones are good because they you get focus faster. Ah, okay, so you have to have with well, support attack, you have to have enhance attack in order for that to be a critical hit. Okay, that is... Let's just unlock everything once. Alright, I'm going to... Belt. Most of your weapons use bullets. I'll give you save. B. Your ship is not very tanky, but you do a bunch of damage. You support attack. Attacks use energy. Actually, we need to this again. Bang Ray. We have your two main attacks right now. Both of them use energy. So, give you Tose. We're giving you a ton of skills already, but you save energy. You've already got potential. Do that. Okay, that didn't help me much. Um, crap. Okay, that didn't help me. So that's good to know that 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 you don't level up your skills that way. We got support defend. Now I do want to give you enhanced attacks so using crits on that. We don't have anyone else who's tanky. I want to hold off on giving Ogita like a bunch of skills. Uh. Pilot list. Okay. So. Alright, so aside from the So um of uh, these characters uh, you have a mix of things with ammo capacity and things with energy costs, so These all go up with, with the leveling up as well. Terrain handling skills come up separately. And then there's... Uh, let's go to the skill program. Lottie. You need both of those.
So, Tobia. Um, I just want to give everybody all the skills. Like, those are all the skills, but. Yeah, I want to give. Phobia. Hit and run. I need your protection because you are squishy. Also, I want to give you Proud Ace. Thank you very much for watching. If you enjoyed the show, please like and subscribe. And also consider backing my Patreon. Patreon backers get episodes up to one week early of this show and any future Let's Plays. Also, please consider backing my coffee. Uh, toss me a few bucks. Also helps support the show, and it's not a monthly obligation or anything like that. 